hello viewers welcome to this video tutorial in this video tutorial i'll be explaining about iterative uh, defining search so make sure you have watched my previous videos on a depth first search algorithm and you have seen all of my videos in a sequence because normally i made video in a sequence so you can understand the topics very easily okay so we're going to learn about iterative defining search and how does it work we're gonna see okay so here our goal note is 11 goal note is 11 and we're going to find out it by using IDS which which is normally known as iterative deepening search so how does it work it uh, you're going to start with a level 0 remember always you're going to start with level 0 then in level 0 you're going to apply your depth first search if you don't find out the goal note then you can increase your level then you can increase your level and again you are going to use that first search algorithm and again if you don't find out your solution or goal node then you can increase your level again that means now your level limit is level uh, up to level 2 so you are going to use DFS again here and if you find out your goal node that's okay but if you don't find out your goal node then you can go to level 3 and once again you can use your DFS from the root node so again I'm telling you so how does it work at first we're going to start with level 0 okay and we're going to use DFS if it is our goal node then we can stop if it is not our goal node then we are going to increase the level so now we have level 0 and level 1 and again you're going to use DFS here that means you have to start uh, you can start with the root node then you can go to left then you can go to right if you find out the goal node then it's okay you can stop and if you don't find that uh, the goal node then you can increase your level okay that means you can start from level 0 and you can go to level 2 and you can use your uh, BFS here okay and if you don't find out the solution still our goal node then you can go to the level 3 and once again you can start with the root node and visit all the nodes by using DFS right so let's get started but before getting started one more thing I would like to say uh, as I said I'm not an uh, English speaker so if I do any mistake in my uh, speaking please excuse me uh, my uh, my goal is my goal is to reach all of you by sharing my knowledge that's it nothing more than this uh, I made lots of videos like more than 300 videos in uh, Bengali language so I'm quite popular in this case but uh, uh, not in English because many of you have requested that's why I'm making videos okay okay fine so we're going to learn iterative defining search the first iteration I'm writing here the first iteration in my first iteration I have only one level and which is level 0 so I'm going to use DFS here so the, the only one node is one so here DFS will give me only one I can visit only one okay so I haven't find out my goal node because my goal node is 11 let's see second time if I find out or not in my second iteration I'll increase the level so this time I have one more level and which is level 1 so now I can start from level 0 and I go I can go to level 1 okay so again you're going to use DFS here root left right root left right that means one two three one two three have we found out our solution or goal node no not yet so let's increase our level so this time we can in go to the next level and now we have three level level zero level one level two again you can use your DFS here so if I use DFS here pre-order strategy then I can go root left and again this one is a root so I can write in third iteration I can write down root that means one then I can come to the left and again this is a root node so as I said in DFS you remember root node left node right node so this is how uh, the pre-order strategy work so I can start with the root node remember we have a uh, level uh, we have three different level level 0 level 1 and level 2 and we're going to use DFS here so start with the root node root then left then right 
root and when i came to the when i come to the um, root left node then uh, this one is also a root node so root left and this one is a root node so i can come to the uh, i can uh, pick this one up and again i can come to the left node okay so one two four one two four then my left node is finished so i can visit right node that means five then this side is finished so i can go to the right side again this one is a root so i will give the priority to the root so i can write down here root root node then i can go to the left node then i can go to the right node so we haven't find out our goal node yet so we can increase the level that means we can go to the level 3 now so from level 0 to level 3 we can traverse and we can use our dfs okay so let's see how does the fourth iteration work so you are going to start with the root node uh, it's just like dfs you remember i have shown you already if you haven't seen that video go and watch that video how does the dfs work i have already shown it so we are going to start with the root node one then we can come to the left and this one is also root node so i'm going to take this then i can go to left and this one is also root so i have to take this one and then i can go to the left node so once i finish with the left side then i can go to the right side nine so this part is finished now you can come to the this side and again this one is a root node so you have to take it then you can come to the left side and once you are finished with the root and left then you can go to the right side so we are finished with this part as well okay so now we can go to the right side which one is also a root three is a root then you can go to the left side and then you can go to the right side okay uh, remember we find out our goal node here our goal node was 11 as i said and uh, we have find it out and this is how the uh, iterative deepening search work so you can uh, try this one out uh, by your own or uh, okay